Todd Boehly has dropped a major hint over Mauricio Pochettino's future after revealing the huge change he's seen in Chelsea's last two matches. The Blues appeared to have turned a corner in recent weeks after finally pushing themselves into the European spots. Chelsea sit 7th in the table after losing just one of their last 12 Premier League games. And their last two results saw them smash 7 past London rivals Tottenham and West Ham while keeping consecutive clean sheets. Chelsea first dismantled Spurs at Stamford Bridge, winning 2-0 to do the double over their neighbours. They then thrashed West Ham at home 5-0, producing a silky performance along the way. Read more in FOOTBALLDAV that David Moyes lands new job just days after West Ham announced he is set to leave Charlie's Angel win Charlie Sloth's Mercedes G-Wagon or £100,000 alternative from just 89p Chelsea now face final matches against Nottingham Forest, Brighton and Bournemouth as they make a play to finish sixth. And that could see Pochettino remain in the hot seat after previously coming under fire from disgruntled fans. Just several weeks ago, he was feeling the pressure after a dismal 5-0 defeat to Arsenal. But Chelsea chairman Burley claims the performances against Spurs and West Ham have heralded a major change in attitude. Most read in football a U revoir Mbappe confirms exit in emotional video and hints at Real Madrid switch well I never forgot an ex-England and Premier League star unrecognisable with top knot toff to take Everton face fire sale while on brink of administration 9 point deduction Eurovision Dream Team Euros is live. Play now and compete for £50,000 prize pot best free bet sign up offers for UK bookmakers he reckons the atmosphere has improved considerably following the Blues climb up the table. And the Americans' positive words hint that Parch is set for a reprieve for at least another season. Ex-Chelsea and England wonder kid now unemployed Burley said, We've seen the last two and a half games, at least in the second half at Villa, 2-2, and Tottenham and West Ham where we played just beautiful football. It was so fluid, it was exactly the way we drew it up, when we came out of the back, built up and moved up the pitch. It was very organized and the number of shots we had on board. In those games you could really start to see what we were working on coming together. Even the commentary has changed over the last two and a half games. I've never seen anything change so quickly. How Pochettino can solve Chelsea's midfield crisis, thanks to the works of a 13th century poet by Andy Dillon IT, is highly unlikely that Mauricio Pochettino is familiar with the work of Rumi. Whether the renowned Islamic poet and mystic had the tactical dilemmas facing Chelsea's head coach in mind while dreaming up his scholarly works in 13th century Afghanistan, we will never know. It's fair to say Rumi was not a regular in the shed at Stamford Bridge. Yet one of his most famous quotations strikes right at the heart of Pochettino's problems trying to transform his team into consistent challenges at the top end of the Premier League.
It was Rumi who wrote so prophetically, two birds tied together. They will not be able to fly even though they have four wings. He could have scribbled that on the back of his program from so many of Chelsea's games this season with regard to Moses Caicedo and Enzo Fernandez. There is a feeling among regular Chelsea watchers that while it is a blow on a personal level for Fernandez to be ruled out for the rest of the season with his injury problem, it may yet turn to Pochettino's advantage. For it allows Caicedo to roam that patch in front of his defence with greater freedom. Both players are exceptional individual talents. Read Andy Dillon's take on Chelsea's midfield in full. Or check out all of Andy Dillon's articles.